All right, we're going to take a look at how easy it is to generate reports in Geomagic Qualify and Qualify Pro. Um, in particular, we're going to look at generating 3D PDF reports. So what I have here is a wrap file where I've generated some simple inspection results. Um, started off with this CAD model of this generator stand, and I've been comparing it to this scan, and I have some results and uh, those results also include um, a 2D compare view um, as well. Uh, so let's go ahead and take a look at the um, 3D compare results. Now I'm going to go ahead and add some annotations. Now everyone is probably familiar with the standard um, dimensional annotations I can add. So I can just pull those off areas of interest and see all of my 3D deviation information. One of the things that we've done that's new in 2012 is added a new annotation type called the zoom annotation. So for example, let's say I wanted to give the user a close-up view of this hole, but I didn't want to um, have to create a user-defined view and waste um, a whole page on that view. What we allow you to do now is just create um, a detail view that's going to have a, a particular zoom um, and size factor that I can control. So it's just a way to give a user, again, a detailed view in context of a larger view. Great way to convey the information. And then once again, as I've shown in some other demos, um, anything that's been added um, to a model and shows up in the table can immediately be exported to Excel. So having said that, let's talk about generating a uh, report from this. Now I can save this view and just get the screen capture, uh, but one of the great things you can do in Geomagic Qualify and Qualify Probe is generate a report that contains a fully interactive 3D model. And the way I can do that is to simply check this box, select PDF as my output, and click the button. And one of the great things about Qualify is that any inspection results that I create are automatically added to the report template. And the model itself is going to show up as a 3D model that I can rotate, zoom, and pan directly in the PDF with no additional software required. There we go. There's our completed report. Uh, now it has what you'd expect. It's got views of the 3D compare, snapshots of the annotated views, and 2D dimensioning. But again, one of the unique things about Geomagic Qualify and Qualify Probe is that data is also available in an interactive format. So I've clicked on the model and now I have in the PDF report itself 
a view of the data that I can use to zoom in to specific locations. So here I have an area of uh, negative deviation. I can zoom in and see that specific location. I might want to pan over, rotate the model around, and get more specific information on other locations. So this gives the user a lot of freedom to use the information their way and in a way that makes sense to them.